Fires Cape Engineers, Inspector Summary Video, Inspector Tom Curran, Tremont Street, Fall River. You have two aluminum balconies, wood ladders, one in the back of the building, one on the side of the building. They are true bolted to the, they are lag bolted to the building. As you can see here, as you can see here, they are lag bolted to the building, not true bolted as code. The platforms are lagged only, not true bolted as code requires. And there should be a support in the middle where they joined this ladder in the middle. Right there, there's too much gear on it. And this looks like an older one. The one on the side of the building going to the third floor looks newer. It is the same thing. It is the aluminum platform with the ladder. This ladder has three brakes. It seems to be one ladder. It has four light bolts in each bracket instead of three. And your brackets are welded, not bolted like the other one. It has the same issue as the one in the back. It is not true bolted to the building as required per code. It is lag bolted only. And as you can see, the lag bolts here are much tighter than the one in the back because it is bowing in the vinyl siding. You can see the uh, lag bolts are vinyl, bone in the vinyl siding because somebody did do them much tighter here than the one in the back. And in the front of the building, you have a wooden set of stairs that go up to the second floor in the front, which is probably going to be now the new main entrance to this building. The bottom tread is broken there. Uh, it's na nailed there. I can, does not look like it's the post is sitting in concrete as required on concrete. The post here is not setting in concrete. It's in dirt as far down as I could find. As you can see, I dug a hole on both sides a little bit of these posts to show you that it's not sitting on concrete. And you can see here that they those do not look like they're on concrete. They look like the concrete was poured around them. The post here is nailed and not bolted or lagged. You can see the stringers when they cut them. It's all five quarter. The post here is the same thing. It's nailed. They have hangers. <laughs> they have hangers there, but they have extended the timber down because it wasn't long enough for the hangers and put a piece of plywood on the back of it. You can see true bolts up there, and they are tying that to the building. You can see the hangers there. And this same thing here it is not sitting in concrete. It is nailed. It is sitting in dirt. The post here, as you can see, is sitting in dirt. And it goes up. We cannot see how it's secured at the top. You can see that the two timbers are not tight to the post. The post is twisted or it was put up that way, needs to be checked and reinforced. And we cannot check how this is hooked to the building there because of all the vital siding. And here they have hangers. Somebody added the 2x4 onto the bottom of the header. So they can put the stringers in, they probably needed the extra step space, and then they put it with plywood and everything is nailed. Nothing is bolted. You can't see the true bolt, the leg bolts there. They have no idea on the rest of it. And somebody put a new 2x4 on this one, and some new banisters on that, and new 2x4 there to try to reinforce it. But your posts are not tied. You can see the post here where this is supposed to be tied into this. It just has a 2x4 there, you can see the space on it. And you can see how they made the stairs and some of the stringers are cracking. You can see the cracks in them. And they're using a piece of 3 quarter plywood for the riser. And 5 quarter for the tread. So, and they spliced it there. Okay. And they put a piece of plywood inside of the 
to splice them. You can see all three are spliced with a piece of plywood inside. Okay, the stringers weren't long enough. And we didn't do their math right. So they have been spliced. And the bracing here is nailed only. And no screws in it, not sitting on concrete. Thank you.